I'm a real estate agent in the area. My name is Aridi Orlando, and I just wanted to say, I, hello, hello. <laughs> Dude, that was like, that one hurt me. I was like, I can barely take it. So tell everybody where you're at, how long you've been selling and all that good stuff. Sure. I am from New York, Long Island, New York, Suffolk County and Nassau County because we do service both. I've been in the business about three years. My husband's been about two and a half. He joined just a little bit after I did. Cool. Cool. Well, I'm excited. I'm excited to, to get back on the phones here and see what see what's going up there. So who are we call on today? I am calling for sell by owners and right. of the market. Now that could be of the market because they're redrawn or because they expired. One of the two. Okay. So. Dude, I am all about it, bro. I want to see them numbers fly. I want to hear that right. phone right. ring. So we call them for sale by owner or expired or what do we for call sell them? By owners, for sell by owners, withdrawals and it. expired. Let's get it. All right, let's do it. Hello. Hi, is this Rick? I'm sorry? Hi, is this Rick? No, I'm sorry. You got the wrong number. Okay. Okay. Is this a business location? No, it's not. It's a personal cell phone. No. Oh, is, oh, okay. Hello? No. Yes. Okay. Well, I would just, do you have a, just a quick second? I was just calling. I'm a real estate agent in the area. My name is Aridi Orlando. And I just wanted to say... I, hello? Hello? <laughs> Dude, that was like, that one hurt me. I was like, I could barely take it. That was, that was, that was a nice little warm up, I guess. Hello? Hi, is this Albert? Hello, may, hello? I, speak, may I speak with Albert, please? He's not here. Is this Miss Tomei? Yeah, who, who is this? Hi, ma'am. Good afternoon. My name is Aradi Orlando. How are you? I'm fine. Who am I speaking with? My name is Aradi Orlando. I'm a local real estate agent in the area. I was calling because I see that you previously tried selling your property and it was off the market. So I just wanted to find out if you're still thinking about putting it back. It's sold. It's sold already. Oh, my apologies. Congratulations. Yes. Uh, my information came up wrong. Well, you have a great day, ma'am. Okay? Thank you. Bye-bye. Okay, let's have a little heart to heart. Sure. Was that an expired? It said it was already sold. So okay, so this is the thing, right? On mm -hmm. stuff like that, like that was off the market, or you think was off the market, we're not going to say, "Hey, your house was." I didn't know if you wanted to put it back on the market or whatever, right? And then we're not going to say, "Oh, it's sold." Bye, see ya. Right. We want to create the relationship with them, regardless. That's the goal. Right now, you sound like you're just trying to get a deal done. And you're like, okay, no deal here, moving on, right? When really you should be going, leaning into like finding out more. Where did you guys move? How do you like it there? What, is there anything I can do to help you, you know, in the future? I'd love to stay in touch with you. See that lady right there, she could have turned into 20 deals to you over the next 10 years if we would have taken a moment to actually connect with her and grab her data. We're after data here. We're data collectors. Hi, John. Speaking. Hi, John. Good afternoon. This is a radio Orlando. How are you? Very good. All right. Awesome. Um, I'm calling from Exit. I'm a realtor in the area. And I just wanted to find out if your property is still available for sale. Yes, it is. But I don't have a real estate and yeah. I'm not paying any fees. I'm not signing any contracts. Okay. <laughs> I understand. Do you Are you collaborating with my agents at all? No, no agents at all. It's all by word of mouth. Even if they have a client who is going to reimburse and pay them directly, meaning it won't affect the sale of your home. If it doesn't affect the sale of my home and goes down on paper as me selling it for the my asking price and he pays you your commission cash, I don't have a problem with it. As okay, long as great. I'm not involved. Okay, I understand. I understand. Are you currently showing the property? Yes, I am. Am I able to make an appointment to go preview for my clients? Sure. Awesome. Uh, um, I'm, out of, I'm out of town until next week. So it'll okay. be uh, in Tuesdays the 5th or something like that. So I'll be home after that. Okay. So let me just take a look at my calendar. What do you think about Friday the 9th? Tuesday. Yes, I think I can do that. Yes. Unless I get called in for overtime, then I'll cancel because I'm a firefighter and uh, oh. if they need big money, if they need big money to come in on overtime. Oh, of course. Of course. I understand. <laughs> I understand. <laughs> Well, that's awesome. Okay, let me just uh, take your information really quick. Um, can I have the best email address that I can reach you? Uh, call me. I don't have an email address. Okay. I don't do email. Oh, okay. Um, I just wanted to send you my credentials so you would know what I all my information and know who you're going to see. <laughs> I'll, just... I, I'll, I'll see you when you come. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, no problem, John. Um, so let me just verify time. Would 10 o'clock work for you? That's fine. 
10 a.m. Great. All right. So I'm going to set up here in my calendar. I'll shoot you a text with my business card information so you can have that okay. as well. And um, just, call me, just call me when you're on your way so I know that, you know, you're on your way because sometimes things happen. Of course. Of course. Not a problem. Okay. All right. So I'll remind you of the meeting probably the day before in the morning and okay. we'll be in touch. Thank you so much. Okay, great. You have a great Thank day. You. All right. Bye-bye. Bye. I saw Amazon packages on his front door. What was that? Amazon packages. On whose front door? That dude's front door. Yeah. Yeah. And I saw I saw on Facebook he was watching that latest Netflix uh deal. That dude's got an email address, okay? I know. But I am just you, you, I want to get into you, the door. You know what? It's you know property. what? I think you know what? I think it was awesome. Like you pushed back and you said, Well, what if this? And you set an appointment. Right. I think it was awesome. I think there was zero connection though, right? Between you and him. You know what I mean? There's no like small talk. There was no like what I want to know when I'm talking to a first sale owner, what I want to know before I can even try to figure out everything that's, you know, I want to know like in the first phone call, I want to know why they're selling. Okay. You know what I mean? Right. It's like, where are you guys moving to? Like, what's what's going on? You know what I mean? And if I can just get them to just share a little bit of their backstory with me about what's going on and why they're trying to sell, then I really feel like I've got a shot to really help them. Kind of shut down a little bit, but he might open up, you know? Right. So, cool. That was interesting. I enjoyed that. Good job. Hello? Has it? Hi, is this Nakins? Yes. Hi, good afternoon. My name is Radio Orlando. How are you? All right. Hi, um, I'm just calling to see if 107 Pine Road in Massac Beach is still available. Yes. Awesome. Um, okay, so my name is Arady, like I mentioned before. I was calling to see if you're willing to work with any buyer agents. A buyer agent? No. Okay. All right. So um, are you currently showing the property or how? Yeah, I put it on the market Friday. Yeah. Okay, great. Is there any way that I can make an appointment to uh, preview the property? Sure. When do you want to show it? Well, what I'd like to do first is that I'd like to make an appointment for me to, myself to preview the property and then see if it fits any of my clients. Due to the COVID situation, I, you know, we do try to limit the exposure. Yeah, absolutely. Okay. So, and then it will be just me. All right. So, how about Friday yeah. the 2nd? Friday the 2nd. Okay. How about sure. 10, 10 a.m.? 10 a.m. I will be here. Okay, great. Do you have an email address that I can uh, put in my phone number he here on my notes so yes. I can send you all my information? Okay, great. Um, and your phone number is this? This is your cell phone. The best number to reach. Yes, the only phone. It's the only phone I have. I don't. I, I don't have a landline. Okay. All right. Perfect. So then we'll be in touch. I will call you to confirm our appointment beforehand, okay. and then I'll see you there. Okay. All right. Great. You have a Thank great you. day, sir. Take care. You too. Bye. Be safe. You too. You're like an appointment setting machine. Well, I'm just trying to see, honestly, I always felt my strength, my strong suit was in front of people. I used to door knock and all that stuff. So when things changed, I said, you know what? I guess I'm going to have to just become good on the phone. You are good on the phone. You are good on the phone. I like that, especially for sale by owners setting appointments and stuff. Mm -hmm.